Check it out. 69 Chevelle bumper right. That is not even close to factory. Hey, thanks for coming to the channel. I really appreciate all the views I've been getting, all the, all the comments and everything like that. So this one is going to be about uh, how to fix some bolts, how to, how to get a broken bolt out and how to install my intercooler and then my cool bumper that is one off. There's nothing even close to this one. This is the first for a 69 Chevelle, I believe. This is the first time I've seen this style bumper on a Chevelle. And uh, it's all the inspiration from all the other builders that I've seen over, over the years. And uh, anyway, check it out. Hope you like it. Tell me what you think. Sim trim black 31143. Pick it up for two minutes. I also want to thank my wife for coming out there and helping me get the bumper on. You know, you got to have a partner in life, and mine is amazing. All right, let's go stick them out in the sun. Well, now we put all these little bolts in here. All right, let's go shoot this with the trim black, too. So if you're like me and you work on cars, you eventually find a stripped bolt or a broken bolt. Now you can get a bolt extractor, or what I found that works easiest is reverse drill bits. So you find the drill bit that kind of fits in there nicely. I'm gonna try, I'll try the 3 16 drill bit. This is the Milwaukee 2804 20. I absolutely love it, keyless chuck. So you set it in there, you gotta do reverse because it's gonna go backwards. And what you do is it'll eventually bite into there. So we need a little bit bigger bit. And there we go. So this was able to save me so much work. You definitely want to get yourself a set of these reverse threads, or I think they're called left-hand drill bits. Buy yourself a set of these now because you never know when you're going to need them. Cutting well, so I'll spray a little bit of WD 40 on there. Or, yeah. This is for the M6. You drill your hole, it's also called the nut cert, and then you just squeeze it down. And then you've got a nut cert. Then you turn this back dial right. Man, it's really just that easy. So let's put this intercooler in here. I put two bushings on here so I know I have enough of an air gap. Seven eighths. Eighths. We need to mask off the fenders so we don't mess them up. We definitely don't want to scratch this all up. Painted it. Okay, what do you want me to do? You gotta hold one end. Which which side do you want to be on? You wanna be on that side or this sure. side? Sure, I got this side. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna come down, just do not let this fall. Okay. So this has gotta go against here. All right, so there it is. Check it out. We got the bumper on. Check out the gap there. Look at that. That's perfect. Boom. That's how you do a 69 Chevelle bumper right. That is not even close to factory. Bam, baby. Hey, thanks for watching the video for this long. Here it is from the front. Hope you liked my video. If you did, try to comment. I really appreciate it. Click like and follow.